High security measures were taken in Jerusalem during the Feast of Sukkot, which ended on October 5th. Also known as Feast of Booths or Feast of Tabernacles, Sukkot is one of three pilgrimage festivals, festivals that are linked to a pilgrimage. In ancient times, people used to visit the temple in Jerusalem to offer sacrificial gifts. This is a particularly joyful feast. It combines religious themes and agricultural elements. Sukkot originates in the Torah, and it commemorates the booths in which the Israelites lived during their life in the desert after the exodus from Egypt. The hut or booth is a temporary home, and it is seen in all cities in Israel, in homes and in shopping malls. As per tradition, the roof is made from tree branches, like palm fronds, through which one must be able to see the sky while maintaining a prevailing shadow effect inside the booth. The first and last days are particularly festive, but it is on a special morning during this week that the blessing of the rabbis of Israel takes place. This is a significant experience. Every corner giving access to the wall is filled with people. Everyone is there to receive the blessing. As established by the Torah, there were four types of trees used in the ritual blessings on each day of the festivities. Palm fronds, willow, myrtle, and cedar. A simple explanation for this is that the four plant species represent the variety of characteristics of men and nature, which allow each man and each tree to possess their own qualities. For this reason, we must thank God. Sukkot is also known as Harvest Festival, celebrated in autumn after the summer harvest and before the planting of winter crops. One of the main prayer themes is the rain. The farmers thank God for the harvest and they pray to have a year of rain. <laughs>